black hole suns are real, and we just discovered the very first one. Hi everyone, astrophysicist here to talk about a brand new class of celestial object. In March of 2024, scientists using the James Webb Space Telescope started seeing these strange red dots in their data sets. They were everywhere. They were tiny, and they were way, way farther away than the galaxy they were even looking for. Despite the fact that they were so little and far away, they were really, really bright, like way too bright. At first, scientists thought that maybe these were ancient galaxies that had formed right after the Big Bang. But galaxies are made of stars, and stars can only be so bright, and these were way brighter than they could possibly have been if they were galaxies. The math didn't add up. A new hypothesis proposes that these are not galaxies, but they're also not quite stars either. Dr. Rohan Naidu of MIT suggests that these little red dots are actually dense cocoons of gas that surround a central supermassive black hole. Here's why. These things emit light in a really strange way. Usually a supermassive black hole produces x-rays as material falls in and high energy radiation flies out. But there's almost no x-ray radiation in any of these little red dots that we've observed. Instead, if they look like anything, they resemble brand new protostars. So what we think is happening here is that this is a real supermassive black hole and it has an atmosphere of hydrogen and helium. That stuff is falling into the black hole, but it's also blocking the usual weird radiation that would come out. So it really is a real life black hole sun. Pretty cool. By the way, Dr. Naidu is funded through a fellowship from NASA, which is facing 24% cut this year. Also, he worked with 51 other people from 16 countries to make this one result happen. This is the kind of international collaboration that we're in danger of losing. Thanks for tuning in. Feel free to drop any questions in the comments and I'll see you next time.